I think that every day you need to look at yourself in the mirror. You need to call yourself out. Ask yourself what you want and ask yourself what you are or are not doing to get that. I go through these phases where I'll like get really into like one person. Awkwardly fast. Lately, it's been Sam Cooke. You know you make me wanna kick my heels up and Sam Cooke, hey, let that man up here. He'll be up. No, wait, hold it, hold it, hold it now. Let that man up. He's coming up. He's coming. Well, here with me, I have uh, one of the greatest singers here in America, and um, I would say all over the world, Mr. Sam Cooke. I want you to meet him. Come here, Sam. Uh, yeah. Mr. I got the British press here. Mm -hmm. Mr. Sam Cooke, as you can see, like me, he's awful pretty. I could probably listen to Cupid like on repeat. I love Sam Cooke's music. I look at it like a way of, you know, less like a psychotic obsession and more like a way to reverse engineer what other people do. How you like that? I think I write songs really weird, weirdly, and I think that I do. I create things really weirdly. I think that it, it really boils down to the type of personality one has. Um, like I, I think I, I intuit my way through like everything, and I think being like somebody who does that, I like feel through it until it until it looks right or it sounds right. It's sort of like a weird, blind, uh, chaotic, random process. A lot of times, you know, the rewarding part of that is not being able to see the end result until it appears in front of you, and just being like, wow, like this is it. It's awesome. I, I think that uh, that that's really like. For me, that's like the reward that keeps me like writing music and keeps me making art in general. Jeez, that's a, that's a, that's a sound out there, isn't it? A lot of great music started off, it's rooted in like old school blues and old school jazz. Like I think a lot, I think a lot of, a lot of the best music out there in my opinion is clearly rooted and influenced by that. Um, so yeah, in the case of you know Jeff Buckley, I think what initially drew me to him was his cover of uh, Nina Simone's Lilac Wine. Um, Nina Simone is an, another you know huge influence on me um, lyrically and musically. I think of authenticity as a point of maturity because I think that um, a lot of people that start off want to be somebody else, and that's okay. I think a lot of people get you know they see something they want. They, they, they buy into the dream and they want what that person has and they want to be that person. But I think eventually they realize that the strongest suit they can play is the cards they were dealt with. And it's silly for me to try to be good in the way someone else was good. You know, that's not to say that you can't stretch the boundaries and do all sorts of, uh, you know, different things with what you have. Being authentic is like not a, uh, an on and off switch. I think that people can smell authenticity I think they can tell. And I think, I don't know what, what mechanism that is, like that people can just see someone and, and think authentic or not. Um, but I, I think that people can tell. And I think if you're not being authentic, everyone's gonna know and no one's gonna buy into whatever you're selling. So I, I look at it as a, as a point in, in any artist's career, any person's career, where they finally own up to who they are and they embrace it. I think, I think ultimately what everybody wants is just is happiness. So I, I think that, um, you know, Following your dreams, I think the bigger question would be, is this really your dream? One major quality of people that are authentic is I think they're unapologetic. I think they can't hide the way they are. I think that that's, that's a big one. Because like, originally I wanted to say confidence, but that's not exactly true. Like there's a lot of introverted people who aren't confident about what they do, who are totally authentic. And um, I, I, think it's, I think it's the inability to hide who they really are. Birds flying high, you know how I feel. Sun in the sky, you know how I 
feel breeze drifting on by. You know how I feel. It's a new dawn. It's a new day. It's a new. For me, for me.